Hi, Kipster Shadows. This is your Dos Fuegos tutorial. And so uh, this is a nice cello with these silver tapes. So you have an idea where your fingers are. This one has one, this one is three, and this is four. Now, in order to start this piece, you have to bring your one back. So four stays here. Then you need to have a two ready. And then you have to have a one. So the beginning goes like this. Four, 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 two, one, two, three, four. Okay, let's do it again. Four, two, and one. Check those notes with me. Four, two, and one. Okay, ready? Two, set, go. Four, 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 two, one, eight, two, three, four. Rest. Now, the outside part plays a two, and the inside plays open string. So I'm just going to do a uh, two. Two. Okay. Now, seven, you have to practice the different parts, especially when you have string crossings that are difficult. So D, A. Now start a ball. So D and A puts you on an up ball and have to redo the up ball. Four O one O four two A four one two four A two one four two O one two four two slot one A A two four A Count three, four, two, one, eight, two, three, four, five, six. Now, let me go over that, and I'll show you how to practice it. Usually, uh, a good practicing strategy is to get a piece of it and to practice, practice, practice until your fingers learn it, and then add a little bit more and keep repeating. So good practicing always has a lot of repetition. So you don't need to practice D, A, but for O, 1, O, you need to do at least a couple of times. <laughs> Now, if you choose to keep your fourth finger, that might be easier. I don't see why not. So I will go lots of times. Four, oh, one, oh. Make sure that you start a ball. It's going to be much easier than you. It's going to be a little bit awkward if you start a down ball. So D, A. A bow again. Then next four to a four, four to a four, four to a four. Now I will go and I'll practice the whole thing. D A four O one O four to a four. Make sure that you get the slurs. So practice a couple of times. And then D A for A one O for two A four. Practice it a couple of times. A four A four A four A four for coordination. I'm sure that you understand it, but your fingers need to memorize it. And in order for the fingers to memorize it, you need to repeat. Next part. One, two, four, A. One, two, four, A. One, two, four, A. 
high, you can keep your fingers down and you can go around on the A string. And when you come back, you will just lift four, two, one, four, two, one, two, four, A, two, one, four, two. One, two, four, A, two, one, four, two. And next one is probably the easiest because all oh, one, two, four. Now flat one. Next one is tricky, so you have to practice it a couple of times. A two four A, A two four A, A two four A. Next one, four two one A. Okay, now I'm going to go from seven to thirteen. Slowly, D A four A one O four two A four. One, two, four, A, two, one, four, two. Oh, one, two, four, two, one, A, A, two, four, A, three, four, two, one, and six beats. Then, immediately, like previously. Again, about. Now it's a little bit different. Oh, one, two, four, two, one, A, one, two. Now you will shift. You will put your first finger where your fourth finger go. And now this cello doesn't have a tape, but the E is, is three. So. And then you shift back here with. So I would practice going up and down. So from 17. Oh, one, two. Two, two, four, A. Two, two, four, A. Now low on. One, 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 two, one, A. Two. Four, one, two, four, A, four, see, I didn't lift four. Four, one, two, four, A, four, two, four, two, oh, one, two, one, oh, extended four on the G string. Two, rest. Okay. So I am going to go now from 14, slowly, watch the shifts, go up and down, walk, walk, uh, look ahead. D, A. Prepare for the shift, to shift. So that is something that you might want to practice. Make sure that you're in the right place. Okay, then two, 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 twenty-six. Pum, 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 pum. 
Pum, 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 28. One and four. Two and oh. Now high. Now, people that have to play the C sharp, did you see that I went around the fourth finger and I did not lift it from its place? It's so much more difficult to play. Now we are at uh, number 34. Okay, I want to make sure that you guys understand that the rhythm of 26 is pam, 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 pam. Bam, bam, bam. And the rhythm at 34 is bam, 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 bam. <clears throat> now, one, oh, four, four, two, one, oh, four, oh, one. This is difficult. If you run out of ball, I will allow you to change balls and take two notes of the ball. One, oh, four, four, two, one, D, four, oh, one, D, D, one, oh, one, D, four, two, one, oh. Oh, wow. You see those dashes? That means that you should separate notes ever so slightly. Oh, oh, wow. If they had dots, I would separate them a lot. If they didn't have dots, they would probably would have written a half note. But that's not what's written. There are two quarter notes with dashes. So it would be like push, push. At 50. Uh, this is the key change. Now, um, top place right here. I'm going to play uh, the top part first, and then I'm going to play the bottom part. So, four, four. Still a two do. Now you have to go to a high. So this is a D sharp. If D is here, D sharp is here. D sharp and E flat are the same thing. So the next note after D sharp is E. Remember when you played? Now imagine that you're in the same, absolutely same place. But instead of one, you're playing two. So I will still have one on the tape just to give you guidance, okay? So as you go, two, two, go with one on the tape, put quickly two. And then go back. Okay, one more time for the top. I did not lift four. This is 58. Um, now the bottom. Bottom at 50. Four on G. Now three. Not two. Now 
three, Andy. Make sure that you get that one before 58. B, B, F, B, B, B. Now 58. Four, 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 A, four. One, one, three, four. This is a three. Four, 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 A, four. One, one, three, four. A, A, A. One, O, oh, four. One. Now, uh, I wrote it like that, but ideally, um, I would like you to play A, 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 one, O, oh. go to uh, third position. Changing like this, it's very difficult and very awkward. So instead of doing that, do... So go quickly. One, O, oh. Low one. I'm gonna go from 58 again. So I recommend that you learn that place 63, and you have to be super quick going back. Have to literally teleport. Okay, so I am at fifty-eight. Go. That's super ninja skills. Three, one, low one, three, one. Now, one, one, oh, one, two, one, oh, four, one, two, three, four, one, one, oh, one, two, one, oh, four. B on the bottom, B on the top. Okay, and then uh, the next part is easy, four, four, Top one for bottom four. Two, three. Okay, enjoy. 